اللهم يا من جعلت السحر ابتلاء فأنت برحمتك لن تنسانا وأنت جل جل الحمد لله الولي المتقين حق من عبد وأكرم من سئل والصلاة والسلام على أشرف الأنبياء سراجا منيرا ما بعد أحب في الله الحمد لله ثم الحمد لله فو الله جبن مدي سبوتونيتي أجين Alhamdulillah for Allah giving me this platform to tell you and to warn you about things where the enemy uses. The enemy uses things where we do not suspect, where things we think is normal, but in fact it is not normal. These things, they use it to harm. But if you're not careful, you may find things in your house or in your car or any, anywhere else. And that thing could be harming you. You don't know. It could hinder your life. You don't know. It could hinder so many things in your life. But you are not aware of it. Magicians, Allah created them. Magic, Allah created it. There's two always ways, falsehood and the truth. There's always right and wrong. Someone will always do the wrong. There is always evil and good. And someone will always do the evil. So when you are on the good side, know that. the evil will come to touch you by the will of Allah Rabbul Izzah if it was decreed. And Allah says in the Quran, inna kunna mubtaleen, we're ever testing our believing servants. Now, what are the stuff where the shaitan uses and his uh, companions to harm the individual? I'm just going to mention things in brief. Nails. You'd see nails If you see nails in odd places or in your houses, be wary about it. If you see hair being tied somewhere in your gate, anywhere in your bed or, or in your pillow, or anywhere, we'll be wary about it. If you see tin just hanging out around in your garden for some time, for nobody has placed that tin, be wary about it. If you see a wood with nails that is hanging around in front of your garden or back garden or in your house, be wary about it. If you see padlocks, which is this is the subject I'm going to talk about because these here are padlock being discovered in a house in Nottingham. So if you see padlocks, keys, be wary about it. If you see... eggs outside or if you see water splashed in your in your window or in your wall and you don't and it's not raining or the rain cannot even touch you should be worried thinking what is happening you should ask yourself these questions and the list goes on or if you see somebody dog in front of your front garden or back garden and you have not done it then you should investigate you should check you should be worried about it or in your toilet anywhere anything you see old things crazy things where they are not supposed to be there but they are there then you should consider that this is a threat for your life and you should straight away want to remove it now these are padlocks sihr in allah sabutul sihr in allah sabutul this a padlock one was meant for a woman padlock two and nails It was meant for a woman not to get married. She's struggling to get married. Inshallah, may Allah make those male and female who are not married to get married. Their padlocks, keys, padlocks, keys. This is to lock the individual risk because marriage is... He is risk. Sihrin Allah saibutul, sihrin Allah saibutul, sihrin Allah saibutul, sihrin Allah. So this is padlock and keys. This woman, she's struggling with marriage. No proposal comes. No. At all. Someone has done it on her. According to them is the dad. The dad is behind it. I don't know for what purpose Allah knows best. I cannot, I cannot be able to even think. What was the reason behind that man? But it is what it is. Allah knows best why he did that. So, inshallah, stay tuned all the way to the end. I will explain how to dissolve this and how to destroy this. Black magic of padlocks and key. The magic of padlock and key is one of the most dangerous act of magic known. 
in which magician uses padlocks and keys before discussing the symptoms and of padlock and key magic first i must explain the magic of padlock and, and locks and keys the magic of padlocks and keys are type of magic that magician do most of the time to lock the risk the door is done for locking doors or locking somewhere locking somewhere so they lock the livelihood of the individual job marriage business to block happiness to lock happiness of the individual she just give him depression after depression and allah knows best padlock and key magic is a kind of different type of magic that aims to do much evil to the individual or to the person than any another magic because this is used iron and when it's locked and the key is disposed somewhere very far is hard to undo it and allah knows best the danger of black magic of padlock and key lies in fact that most of the cases is performed by very evil magician male or female or evil men may Allah curse be upon them going to want to perform this type of magic the goal of the black magic of padlock and keys is to make someone suffer the malicious goal is the person he has to suffer look at that look at the intention look at the how evil the individual is that he wants the individual to totally suffer hasbun allah wa ni'mal wakil such as disease like cancer diabetes bring damage lock someone from getting married lock someone business job livelihood lock someone from having relation husband and wife get locked you can't even go to that wife you can't even the husband cannot husband is dead this is what the black magic of padlocks and keys lock someone intellectually intellectually the person cannot think his brain is numb cannot even think anything for himself physically and financially boom is locked example a woman who is divorced and want to revenge the husband because she heard husband wants to get married to some other woman and then she goes and locks him that he cannot produce this is one of it this is one of the types there's so many ways but they use padlocks and keys in this case this padlocks and keys we discover is to lock that individual marriage no marriage no financial coming into that individual a woman goes to the magician the one who wants to do harm to the husband ex husband goes to the magician and tell the magician that i don't want that man to have any intimacy with any woman or make him feel make him be cold in terms of love having affection of any another woman and this is how evil he is black magic of padlocks the magic always affects in three ways night day and ibadah this always the individual will struggle in any magic at day the magic of padlocks and keys symptoms forgetfulness a lot disorientation and lack of focus feeling of locks and padlocks in the body can't move the individual who always want to sit somewhere if the individual is in the bed he feels that he's been locked in on top of the bed allah knows best his livelihood will be locked feeling tight in the chest sometimes cannot be able even to breathe feeling like some locks in the body that's how you feel with the black magic of padlocks and feeling pain in the back area lower back this is normally the gateway 
of spiritual problem of majority of the problem the lower back and the shoulders feeling numb and extreme in the feet in the hand sometimes the whole body or sometimes the feet and the legs feeling fear or panic for absolutely no reason nervous of no reason at all creating problem for most trivial reason in the house feeling chill always feeling distance in the body like ants are crawling and this differs as well there's a lot of symptoms of magic uh, branches of magic which these symptoms have the crawling of the body very clear distance in act of worship especially prayer and reading quran uh, very far the affected person feels like there's someone is following constantly someone is behind him or someone is walking with him or watching him Sips, suffer from horrific nightmares kawabis disturbing nightmares disturbing dreams horrific dreams ru'ba in the case of binding the house the husband and or lover the man is obedient if this one was locked to a husband or a wife the wife will be 110% obedient or the husband will be absolutely obedient he or she does not see anybody else if this was done on a sihr to be obedient seeing keys and magic and padlocks in the dreams seeing locked in somewhere in a box or in a room you can't go out in a dream seeing cage dope in a dream and allah knows best how to deal with black magic of padlock and keys first is when you get like this you go and find acid to dissolve this i have dealt with a brother a few few months back where they have done it black magic of nails and the nails there was no other way until to dissolve so he went and get acid battery acid from somewhere i don't know where but he got it and he put the nails in there and the nails dissolved totally and alhamdulillah until today he's absolutely fit and fine his symptoms gone he used to feel collapsing in his house and not waking up always alhamdulillah now he's okay so you have to find something acid or something to dissolve make sure the padlock is totally dissolved the iron is totally dissolved you read and blow from a distance on the acid and then you put these inside slowly so you don't get burned by it and then wait even if it's cold was going to be a couple of days because for him it took a couple of days for it to dissolve make sure it's very far away from the children and it dissolves totally once it dissolves go and chuck it very very far away now treatment is to anil allah number one number two dua number three is istighfar number four number three is idhkar uh, morning and evening and salah number four is surah al-baqara daily if the individual doesn't know how to read surah al-baqara then he needs to learn if he doesn't know how to read even the quran then he needs to learn if he knows how to read the quran tell him to hold tight with surah al-kafirun he reads a lot inshallah and Allah will give him victory. He read that surah to kafirun and surah to falq and nas on the water, drink that water, pour it on the body. Inshallah by the will of Allah that individual will be okay. I ask Allah to make it easy for the believing men and women out there who are inflicted and get a bottle of water, bottle of olive oil, read on it put it on your body because this body that was done on the black magic of padlock and keys it feels like it's been locked on the joint or all over the body 
because of that magic. We ask Allah to preserve us and preserve the believing men and women from any type of magic. Black magic of padlock and keys from the Ruka talk. Abu Yahya. Wa akhru da'wana. Wa salamun ala al-mursaleen. Wa alhamdulillahi rabbil alameen. Ta yatabayyana lahum anahu al-haq.